Ice Spice has been under fire lately for allegedly employing a single cover created by artificial intelligence, but it appears that she has more serious accusations to respond to. Welcome back it's your host Nancy Brown. If you are new here make sure you have subscribed to our YouTube channel. Furthermore, on Saturday, April 27th, an artist going by the name of Baby Storm, who claimed to be her old best friend, accused her on Twitter of a host of concerning actions, remarks, and viewpoints. The primary allegations, which remain unsubstantiated, purely conjectural and completely unaddressed by the Bronx MC are that she engages in discriminatory and coloristic behavior in her personal life, that she attempted to ruin Storm's music career by substituting her for another best friend whom she despises in private, that she cheated on her boyfriend and producer Riot USA by sleeping with Lil TJ, and that she ridiculed and disparaged Dochi Eye's remarks regarding colorism. Naturally, all of this may sound like a lot, but we want to be clear that Ice Spice has not yet responded to any of these accusations, they are merely claims. Baby Storm offered reported text screenshots between them that purportedly depict a lot of this conduct in an effort to support many of her claims. Messages from Storm to Riot, alleging that the Fisher creative had cheated on him, were also seen in these screenshots. As a result, a lot of people are discussing these accusations' validity online and whether or not they are sufficient to completely discredit her. Though Moni Slaughter is not overly impressed, Ice Spice may be one of the most successful young femsies out there at the moment. Any in here loves Ice Spice. Ew, uh, let me be quiet. The celebrity recently discussed which other women in the business she's enjoying right now and who she would be willing to sleep with on Shirley Jew's podcast, Shirley's Temple. What girl do you like right now that's out? Because I know you like girls. Like, what girl would I fuck? Yeah. The Delhi artist, in her opinion, would not make the cut, but Tyla has a shot. Yeah. First of all, I want her to put her tongue back in her mouth she said of ice spice must your tongue hang to your chin in every photo when asked what she has against the bronx born performer slaughter said that her onstage antics and music just aren't her style can we please get some beats that are not mario brothers can we move past keeping it a stack and gra 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 or whatever the is going on i can't deal she continued by emphasizing the value of true artist development as her father had taught her and urging artists to add some spontaneity to their performances in response to the question of whom she is a fan of she mentioned tyla can somebody get up there and do something other than bend over the south african singer whose song water went viral this year First of all she's from South Africa, she explained. Second of all she's drop dead gorgeous. Third she can actually sing. Slaughter also complimented Tyla on her sense of humor, which she put on display on the Jason Lee show, and her snatched figure. But Slaughter isn't the only artist who doesn't impress him. She offered her sassy critique of Cesar in another segment of the interview, labeling the snooze singer a lazy vocalist. In a recent episode of her own podcast, Candace Owens took aim at Ice Spice. In doing so, she criticized the rapper's newest single, Thank You The Ice Spice dropped off the viral track last week, featuring the now infamous bar. Think you the shit, bitch? You not even the fuck. And if you're wondering whether or not it's a good song, what do you think? It's called Think You the Shit Fart. Owen said before playing a clip from the song. Now I think we can all admit that we've fallen as a society. I wouldn't say that was Mozart or Beethoven, but I'm not all of these mainstream media publications that routinely run to defend this kind of music similar to what they did with WAP, the most disgusting and filthiest lyrics I've ever read. They will then sit down and write an article trying to convince you that what you just heard was magical and they did this with this Ice Spice song. I just want to live in a society where we can all acknowledge that a song that's entitled Think You the Sh Fart is in fact itself a sh fart. With her new song Think You the Shit Fart, Ice Spice seems to be taking another stab at Lado. One of the most well-known new musicians at the moment is Ice Spice. Despite her sudden rise to fame due to the song Munch, she has managed to stay current. All in all, she exudes personality, and her music appeals to a wide audience. She has also had some extremely successful duets with musicians like Nicki Minaj and Taylor Swift. She has, however, in the past had conflicts with a few well-known musicians. She appears to have a running argument with Lado about this. This beef's origins are a little mysterious. Nevertheless, they have insulted one another and have not stopped showing how much they despise one another. Ice Spice made an appearance on Friday and released a brand new song titled Thank You The Shit. You the shit, bitch. You not even the fuck. After being teased for a while, this song is now officially released. I got my foot on the next, I can't let up. Spice raps on the song. Up. She all on the floor, so I get up. Get Immediately, fans saw this as a reference to Lado's track Put It On The Floor. You can imagine how fans felt on social media when Megan Thee Stallion and Nicki Minaj started beefing at the same time. Thanks for watching. Tell us what you think in the comment section and most importantly subscribe. See you.